I would like to apologize for my choice of nails. I was originally going to try out some of my more green bottles, but I don't know. There's just something about this scent that really lured me to it. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be just kind of going over the different lotions that I have in this series. Um, so if you're not interested, keep scrolling, I guess. I don't know. Um, just something different because I do have other hobbies other than my doll collecting and one of them is my obsession with lotions. I've talked about it a little bit but I, I don't know if I just have dry hands but my hands literally bother me so badly. So I'm obsessed with lotions so obviously whenever Bath & Body Works does any sort of sale I'm like showing up no matter what. Um, so this is one of the, the lotions that I picked up and I keep calling it a lotion but it's not a lotion. This is a Bath and Body Works body cream. I did once. Somebody had commented that lotions are like thinner, better for like places where it's hot maybe. Is that what it is? And then body creams are better for places where it's cold I guess. That, is that correct? Um, and then like body creams are thicker. So this is a body cream thousand wishes it's got ingredients that i honestly cannot pronounce um so close up here there's um sparkling quincy nope I, is that the word um i want to say that is but it i don't know anyways and gilded amber that one maybe can i guess uh but i don't know the other ones um this is rich and luxurious for instant moisturization um leave skin feeling soft smooth and replenished uh i could not tell you the scents like what they are because i don't know them i have put this on my hands for a little bit and so i've been smelling them definitely like a sweet scent um i'm trying to figure out like what kind of scents are like my favorite i do like this scent um it's not like a sweet, no, it's sweet. It's not like a candy scent, you know, like what I mean? Like a vanilla, like a food scent. It's maybe floral, I don't know. Um, not like an earthy. It's definitely like a very sweet, it's not flowery, I don't think. Um, I'm smelling it, I just, I think the only way I can describe it is sweet. Um, it's very like pretty, like, I don't know any other word other than like girly scent um this bottle is definitely really pretty I wanted to just kind of casually mention that because when I first went to Bath and Body Works I was definitely lured in by the pretty bottles um I originally got two perfumes and two lotions like the first time that I went when they had this sale uh like the what it was their big like Christmas sale um what's it called 495 sale anyways um like their bottles definitely attracted me in and now I tend to just like pick up every bottle and smell all the lotions and if I like the scent toss it in my bag but with this one it's definitely very pretty like this holographicness I don't is that the term I think it's holographic it's very pretty it definitely matches the vibe I absolutely love it I'm staring at it right now like playing with like the rainbows it's very I don't know just so pretty and you can tell why it lured me in and why my nails don't match this bottle because I just get so distracted it's a very very nice scent the only thing that I would say because one of the things that I want to do is I'm trying to look for a future perfume to get um is it body spray I don't I don't know what they call them here um I guess it's a body mist because you're supposed to put it on and then I don't I don't know okay <sighs> anyways I am curious on what this would smell the perfume would smell like or body mist because one of the things that I have noticed is that not all of like the scents smell the same I now only smell lotions because that's what I'm picking up like I don't smell the perfumes and then get the lotions you might be like that's obvious but I feel like there aren't that many testers of lotions definitely the most recent time that I went I've definitely noticed that there are way more lotion testers but the majority of the testers before were the body mists and I would smell the body mist and then 
it I would like like the scent and I haven't had one where like I've disliked the lotion but they're definitely different in my opinion um so now no matter what if it doesn't have a um tester I still smell the lotion you may feel like you're a terrible human being but I'm not using it I'm just smelling it want to point that out anyways this one I'm curious because I think it does have a very, like, light scent. Like, I have some lotions that I'll put on and I'll be like, I am not even, my hands are not near my face. How do I smell this? And I definitely smelled it a little bit with this, but I don't think the scent is, like, insanely strong compared to other ones that I have. Specifically, there's a vanilla one. My god, it, your hands could be in the other room and you can still smell the scent. So I'm curious on how this would smell in the body mist form. I feel like it would be very different. Um, my mom always says that, like, you're supposed to build with them, so you're supposed to buy the whole collection. She loves the beach one, the beach line, uh, and has, like, everything for it. Again, like, building the scents, and I only use the lotions. So, I'm, I would be very curious to smell this in the body mist. I keep calling you perfume, so I'm body mist. Um, but, side note, I did buy the body butter of this, so if you're curious to see that, let me know, but I did like the scent of that, so maybe, maybe this will be on my, my body mist, uh, ad, especially because it's still active, like, I know this scent is in store, so, versus some other ones that are probably gone, um, but this one is a really good scent, I really like it, it's very pretty, um, to look at, and it's very pretty, I guess, my way of describing the scent because I really don't have like a description of what it is let me know if you have it is it's a very pretty scent um and I don't know it's really nice so definitely definitely one I'll be using a lot more um because typically when I use lotions I body cream sorry <laughs> I, I um I'll use one consistently consistently is that a word until it's gone but I'm trying to, like, interchange them, you know what I mean? Maybe use one once a month. That would take forever because I've got so many. I don't have just 12, but it's a very nice scent. Definitely going to be using it more, especially now that I have a body butter of it. So stay tuned if you want to see that. Okay, so here's after, like, rubbing it in. I definitely put a good amount. Like, I don't put usually this much. The sheen could be the sweat on my hands keep that in mind <laughs> um but it definitely feels very nice and like feels like there's lotion on my hand which the amount that I put there should be um and that's what I need so I cannot feel the texture of my hands um my hands are definitely warm so I think that a lot of the sheen is sweat I'm not going to lie um also why do my hands look so weird on camera and maybe it's because I've been rubbing them, but they look patterned. Anyways, ignore the cut. I <laughs> I don't know. I like this lotion. It definitely feels nice. It feels good. It's still oh, cream. I'm sorry. I still don't know the difference, but maybe I think I have lotions and creams. So we'll tell. This is a cream. I got to remember that, but it feels nice. It feels moisturizing. Is that the word? Uh, is that what this is? Um, It feels that's that's all that I got uh it did I did forget to say when I was going over it I think it's yellow is it okay there are some that are yellow and some lotions that are white I I can't tell I'm not gonna lie it looks like white here but it definitely looks yellow <laughs> go back in it definitely looks yellow in the bottle but it definitely looks white here if you know what I mean um so I don't know don't ask but that's lotion Thanks for watching.